So, because of my condition, I sleep quite a bit, and I went to sleep around noon yesterday, woke up around 5am today, and was promptly informed that uh, there was an attack on the capital, and... Oh boy, um, the, the cause of it was... I, I want to say it's surprising, but it deeply isn't. Uh, Donald Trump in vi inciting violence, and uh, it's just... How his followers have acted has seemed extremely cult-like. It's disturbing how they only accept word from him, how they only believe in him. They don't trust any other source but him. He might as well be their god. And I am a big advocate for protesting because protests definitely should be a thing so that way people can make clear, hey, these are what our intents are. The intent, the uh, protest that turned riots in 2020, I believe in rioting through just causes, and I believe that that was a just cause. I believe that whenever you go to peacefully protest and repeatedly get attacked, you have the right to defend yourself. And this, this was just a blatant attack on people just doing their jobs. People that, while I have issues with various senators, especially the ones that incited violence on this, um, it's... It's just very hard to believe that so many people were willing to do this. They lost. They lost the popular vote two times in a row. They keep going, well, uh, two different elections in a row. The first one they got off on a technicality because uh, Trump and basically paid off a good section of the Electoral College and Russians, yada yada. That's been something that's been talked about by people for years now, and... Maybe I'll do an in-depth look at the history of Donald Trump once he gets in jail, but for right now, we're going to look at the present. They... simply wouldn't believe it. They... despite having shown in the 2016 uh, wanting to believe in the Electoral College versus the popular vote, they keep going from... Uh, state to state demanding recounts of the votes because that's definitely going to do something correct because having more votes in the popular vote is what makes a winner which is flatly not the case in america i'm not sure exactly what I'm going for here. I'm just deeply disturbed by the information of this and how people have acted. And honestly, I I'm looking forward for Trump being put in jail. I'm looking forward for his cult members that attacked the Capitol to be arrested, put on trial. Because this just isn't acceptable. They aren't being marginalized. They're not having their voices minimized. Their voices were heard and lost. They went out. They voted. They basically threatened counters with wherever they went because of Trump wanting to have his people there to ensure things went smoothly. And it really seems like he was just trying to start a dictatorship in a democracy and is still trying to. 
we have another two weeks, and who knows what we're going to be like at that point. There might be some final ploy from Trump to do something with this. He has had several messages from his Twitter taken off that the Twitter guidelines wouldn't allow, but just makes me wish that there was a more official way to uh, look back on that, because for, so far from what I've seen, nobody has managed to screen cap those. Uh, if you've seen any, please feel free to link them down in the comments, because I want to read them. I want to see what this orange fuck has to say about what he's done. Calling these people, uh, saying that they, that they're loved is just deeply disturbing, and I'm hoping that this won't happen again in the future, but let's be honest, America's been a dumpster fire for a while now, and while it does have good aspects of it, we're going down, and we're going down fast, and it's gonna be very hard to stop that. Um... With the recent bits from just yesterday, I'm surprised that we haven't had war declared on us by another power that would use this as an opportunity to attack while at least one of the branches of government are in disarray. Well, two, because one of them is attacking the other. And also we're coming up on a transition of power, which Trump is refusing to go through cleanly, so... It's really the perfect time for an attack to happen. I'm just surprised it hasn't happened yet, and... I honestly don't know which country would do it first. There's a lot of people that hate us. There's a lot of people that have looked at the work that this man has done, and has had that be the reason of why they hate America, and I honestly can't blame them for that. Anyways, I just had to record this because I'm pissed off, and it's 9am, and I have my nice little cup of hot chocolate here that I'm gonna go sip on, so, yeah.